Okay, yesterday we were speaking about again salting something which is a form of uh, pickling. Salting eggs is mutan on Shabbat, and there's no problem of again pickling. Very important halacha that even though you're allowed to salt the eggs, you should only do it for that sa'udah. You can't prepare the eggs in the morning for sa'udah shalishi. You can't do that. You have to prepare the eggs now for the sa'udah that's now. You want to prepare the ones for sa'udah shalishi? So right before sa'udah shalishi, whatever the amount of time that you, know, you would need to prepare, whatever it is, you can prepare, but it has to be done before that sa'udah, for that sa'udah. Not you're doing it now for the sa'udah that's going to be in a few hours from now. You know, now it's the morning and I'm doing it for the afternoon. That's no good. That should, one should not do. Another halakha, we know that the person is not allowed to smear. Smearing on Shabbat is forbidden. So a guy wants to take cream and smear it on his hands. Can't do that on Shabbat. It's a suit. <coughs> what if I have certain creams that I have to take what the doctor says, whatever. Okay, so you have to ask your local rabbi what you should do in such a case. Generally, smearing is forbidden. You're not allowed to smear. Uh, says, but smearing food, for example, you have butter, and you want to smear butter on your bread, and you're smearing the butter right onto your bread, nice and soft, mutar. One is allowed to do that. That's not a problem. Again, the suit of smearing is only smearing onto your skin, putting lotion or something like that onto your skin. That would be a suit. However, <laughs> smearing food onto the bread, like butter or something like that, that would be mutar, and there's no problem whatsoever on Shabbat.